we're going to jump across to our good friends, Ehang. So initially I thought, look, Joe be pushing for Japan, Osaka. It was great. They were there. Um, Archer then doing their deals with Japan Airlines and Korean Airlines. It made me think it all came sort of like in conjunction with Ehang bringing out their new VT-35. And is it Joby and Archer trying to get the market share in there before Ehang gets fully up and running and tries to dominate that um, Asian market? Now, look, VT-35 doesn't really scare me. I don't think it'd scare Archer or Joby. I think it's a different use case. It's going to be fully autonomous. Um, two passengers, so doesn't really compete with the four passengers. But look, maximum takeoff weight I think is nine hundred and fifty kilos. Of that, is it around two hundred kilos of um weight can be put on it? Um, four hundred or so mile range. But it is what it is. It's a lot better than um the other aircraft but it doesn't like it doesn't really excite me that much i know some of you ehang investors will tell me completely differently look i think ehang will dominate the asian market once they get their bigger e-vitals out um they have them in production but until they actually come out i'm i'm not that worried about ehang